Good evening. Good evening. This is your Reverend Bishop Eddie Long. Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to take this time to send a message to all of the people who've been wondering what is wrong with Eddie Long. Yes, folk has asked too many questions concerning my health. People wants to know what is wrong with Eddie Long. I hear people joke about me. Eddie Long is long gone. A friend of mine called me up. A friend of mine who I've known for over 20 years called me up and said, Eddie, are you related to Gonzo from the Muppets? I hear all the jokes. I hear them. People are wondering, what kind of disease do Eddie Long have? What disease does he have? Did he catch it off of... Shirley Caesar or Cicely Tyson. I hear the jokes. Praise God. People are wondering, taking their time to try to figure out what I do have. But I'm going to outlive everybody. I've just been eating vegetables. I lost 200 pounds eating about 45 bananas a day. About a pound of uh, radish and 16 uh, apples a day. No starch. No starch. Praise God. And I know you're wondering, what do I have? What kind of disease do I have? Does he have HIV? Cancer. Syphilis. Malaria. Mad cow disease. Cryptosporinium. Gingivitis. Gout. Lockjaw. Tumors. I know. And the answer is yes. Yes. I have all of that, but the next question, family, is what are you going to do about it? Yes, and I hear folk talking about the fact that my good friend, comedian Lavelle Crawford, stopped hanging out with me after he started looking the way he does. Praise God, praise God. Yes, I got five rocks and I ain't thrown one yet. And at the rate I'm going, I doubt I'll be able to pick up any rock. Praise God. Praise Him. Praise Him. Praise Him. Praise Him. I haven't left. I'm still here. I know you was wondering if I left. No. I'm still trying to figure out when are the people going to come and see me, the Chris Tuckers of the world. All the people I led in ministry, I led them in ministry. Now that I'm sick, because my clothes is looking more like Don Cheeto was my tailor, you have a problem with me. Can't you see? I'm going to outlive everyone. I bet you if it was meant for me to bet anyone that I can outlive them, today's January 5th. Let's make a bet I outlive you. January 5th, 2017 to March 1st. I guarantee you I, I'll live you, but if it's past March 1st, then we have a problem. Praise God. Praise God. Praise Him. Praise Him. I'm still here. I know you're wondering why haven't I left yet. Because I have nothing to do other than continuously lose weight and look as if somebody has made a bet that I can go on a fast for 27 years straight. Praise God. Praise Him.